Man like David Beckham, you know, this is his team. I believe he's the president of this team into Miami. So we're going to check out what they're saying. Shout out Mark Clark, bruv. Um, so yeah, obviously no nickname. It's a very new squad owner status, loves the club and no content the competition. Their honours are obviously going to be empty. I doubt they would have won anything in terms of history. There's nothing there, as as I just said. So yeah, let's see. They've got a very good squad budget, but then again, this is um, Creator Club, so it's not really accurate. Let's see what they're saying anyway. We're going from John McCarthy all the way to Julian Carenza. So yeah, let's see what Inter Miami has. All right, first we've got my like John McCarthy now. Um, 28 years of age, goalkeeper, defend, 14 reflexes, which is really good, 13 agility, and then 11 one on ones bruv. Um, I don't know if he's first choice or backup. By looking at him, he probably would be a decent first choice. Just know that you're going to have to play a deeper line, yeah? Because man's got 11 one on ones He will get pecked on one on one situations. That's all I can really say because he is very average. He is 28. In a big league, he would not be accepted. That's why he is over here. Safe. Man at Jamaica. All right, next we've got man at Dylan Castanhira. Bruv, um, cool. Man, man's 25, 10 agility, 14 reflexes, which is really good, but 10 one on one. So, obviously, man's going to tell him hang up the boots or the gloves, both preferably. Football's not your sport. Maybe the American football might be for you, but this, this, um, soccer, bruv, soccer, nah, 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 not for you, Starby. Man, like Dylan, bruv, hang, hang up the boots, still say. All right, next we've got my like Drake calendar bruv um sick name man like um drake yeah okay cool 23 years of age he's a goalkeeper event oh my god 13 reflexes eight agility 10 and one eight one on one i mean no no, no 10 one on ones okay cool um man's name is calendar you need to go back in time and re-choose your career bruv because football is not the one for you still i'll just keep it as straight as possible i'll, I'll move on from now like fuck that bruv man like calendar like dead that immediately bruv no way no way is this the guy that absolutely snapped Aaron Ramsey in two, chilling in America. No, 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 it can't be him. Let me just double check. Is it the Stoke? Oh my God, it's him. Oh my God, he even came from Man United. Oh my goodness me. Man like Ryan Shawcross, yeah. If you didn't know, he's the one that um snapped Aaron Ramsey into two. I think he literally broke his leg in it, like his lower leg or something. Snapped him, bruv. Now he's got to move to Inter Miami. And when I look at his stats, let's be real, like take all bias out of it. He's just the perfect guy to snap you, bruv. Like, look at his stats, bruv. Man, man's got mad work rate. Determination on 15. Aggression is not really there. But he's got very good ta tackling, which is what I was expecting, yeah. Nine technique, 10 vision and eight passing. Not really a footballer. I didn't even know he was a centre-back. I thought he was a midfielder. And he's just a no-nonsense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least he's being honest, though. Man's just a simple no-nonsense defender that is just going to take your legs, bruv. As we've seen, shout out Aaron Ramsey, bruv. But yeah, man, like Ryan Shawcross. Man, man will be very good in this league. I'll be real, because he could probably do a thing in a other league as well but yeah man at Ryan Shaw across bruv all right next we've got man at Leandro Gonzalez Perez bruv um he's 28 9 technique 9 vision 11 passing that pivot is really really bad but he's a no notes to center back so you can kind of understand you can really understand physically 15 strength 15 jumping reach is good but obviously um no 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 I mean physically overall it's, it's it's actually really good I'll be real like physically overall it's actually really good just side to side he will get split side to side but that's cool um so yeah just a normal no not to send him back mentally it would already be a disaster as you can see 11 composure 9 concentration 10 decisions just a simple no nonsense defender in this league he'll be decent as well let me just quickly see where he's been in his career uh yeah it's it's uh man's been at arsenal i'll probably rather support that one than the english one i'll be real but yeah a man like leandro gonzalez just a decent no-nonsense defender bruv simple all right next we've got man like nicholas figal cool now um ball playing defender 12 technique 12 vision and 14 passing is a very good pivot you get me that's a very good pivot 12 first touch 12 composure is okay man's talking about the american league so that's calm um 12 acceleration 12 agility 14 pace and 14 strength so physically he's actually really good very good balance as well just the only problem I have with him is that he can't really win headers he can definitely direct them with 14 headers but he can't win them with 12 jumping reach simple as overall he's actually a really good ball playing defender and I would probably if I'm doing a little struggle save man would sign this guy I'll be real man like Nicholas Figal he's a good player still alright next we've got man like Ian Frey he's 18 and that is about it because when I look at the stats bruv I mean he can just tackle the ball very composed and that is it two things that I can really take from that out of how many stats Get me off this card. All right, this has got my like Breck Shea, bruv. Um, 30 years of age, left mid, winger on support, 14 technical ability, 10 vision and 11 passing. That pivot overall is shocking. Just one that I can take from that, which is technical ability. First touch, 14. Um, Pace, 15, which is very good, but 11 agility, 11 acceleration, man, stiff as well. 
only made for a straight line thing where he's only got a decent cross. All he can really do is stand on the left mid, like just stand there, yeah. Run, it will take him a very long time to get to that sprint speed, but attempt to run, yeah, and cross the ball. That's all he can do. I can't even really trust him to do that. Man's got 10 decisions overall. For me, shocking player. And where has he been in his career? Let's just see, bruv. S explains. Man's even been at Stoke. Man's got another Stoke guy over here. But yeah, get me off this car, man. That brick shit. All right, it's got man like Gregor, bruv. Depending on how you want to play, if he's if you like playing with these, you know, destroyers that just run around, kick man shin pads, he's probably the guy for you. Um, what's his stamina? Fifteen? Yeah, definitely, man. Man's just running around eighteen. I mean, sixteen work crates, sixteen determination, and sixteen aggression with sixteen bravery. He does not fear no one but the most high, bruv. Fifteen tackling mean that he's actually got good accuracy with tackling, actually getting the ball as well. Eleven technical. I mean, eleven. For you know, 11 technique, 10 vision and 11 passing just explains my point that he's not made to actually be on the ball. He's just made to be off the ball. Regardless of his positioning off the ball, he's not that guy that's meant to be on the ball for a fact, bro. Man like Gregor, he's just a destroyer, simple as. Let's move on. All right, he's got man like Victor Ilua or Ulua, bruv. Um, defensive midfielder on support. Okay. Um, when you have, Whenever you see a role like that, that is just man that are insecure about their technical ability. I look at the technical ability at CS11 and he's just backing up my point, simple as, bruv. Overall, man's averaging about 10 and 11, which if you was like 18, I would understand, but you're 28, like a decade older than 18, man could never understand it, bruv. Like you just skipped all those years just being mediocre. Look at him now. He's he's very, very, he's very, very bad. I'll be real. Like he's a bad player, man. I'll be real. Like, geez, he's not that great. Still, let me. Okay, um, nice. Now, now we've got man like Blaze Matweedy, man smiling. He's obviously happy in that. Like, I'm expecting him to be taking a lot more wages, but he's only getting that much. Suit yourself in it. Like, if I was here, I'll be like milking that. I'll be real, like, geez. But anyway, anyway, man like Blaze Matweedy, yeah, ball in the midfielder, and and he's looking like a decent no nonce. I mean, man, said no nonce. Um, just just a destroyer, like running around, kicking man shin pads, as you can see physically. Man's 33, he's still got the physicals, man. Good pace, good acceleration, just agility is a bit stiff in it. Very good balance though. Um, 16 strength, um, 16 stamina as well. So he's actually moving around, 18 work rate, 20 teamwork. So he's willing to take in your tactics, play pretty much anywhere. 20 bravery, don't fear no one but the most high. 18 determination and 18 aggression. So he's just a mad passion merchant, yeah. And he hasn't really got the technical ability. So he's definitely just running around and kicking your shins, bruv. But um, yeah, it's it's, it's it's effective, you get me? Man could probably, no, no, no. I was going to attempt to put him on box to box. Um, maybe in this league you could pull it off. Definitely not in a higher one, though. But yeah, man, like Blaze Matweedy, he's he's a good player, man. Just look at the media description, innit? Like he's done his thing over his career. Like he's even got a World Cup as well. Very good player, man, like Blaze Matweedy, bruv. Okay, um, back to back, you get me? Back to back, bruv. Now we've got man like Federico Higuain um, only just found out by reading this guy's name that he's definitely related to Gonzalo Higuain you get me like man knows that now isn't it simple as bruv but yeah I did not know that before but I know it now still now 36 years of age he's a cam cool um 14 technique, 14 vision and 14 passing is a very good pivot. Like that's actually good passing ability. Like he can pass. Dribbling, good in tight spaces and he's got unpredictability with 14 flair. So overall, like as a simple like attacking midfielder or advanced playmaker preferably, man's doing his, like he's doing what he's supposed to do in it now. 13 decisions is under average by one. He is 36. There's nothing we can do about that now. See how the physicals are just gone and you can't control them. With, with uh, mentals like that, you just can't control it still. But yeah, um, not a lot of cams can usually shoot. He's actually got 12 finishing, 13 long shots. That's decent as well. Overall, as a cam, like maybe in his day, let's just quickly see before I say anything stupid. Never mind, bruv. Man's looking at where he's been. And I'm like, yeah, let me let me just stop speaking, innit? But yeah, in the MLS, he's looking like a veteran still. I'll be real. Like, you can already see it there. Like, man, that like veteran attacking midfielder. Um, Federico Higuain, innit? Safe, let's move on. All right, next we've got man like Lewis Morgan, bruv. Flipping shocking now. How can you be this young, yeah? In the MLS, like, listen, 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 man's 24, so he's actually a young age, isn't it? Man's, man's in the MLS. I bet he thought, the thought process behind him moving to the MLS was, I'm going to go over there and shell it down and be the main player. But nah, bruv, you're transfer listed, bruv, in the MLS. That's when you know football is not for you. Simple as, like, simple as, like, man's a winger with 10 agility like there's no way he's playing inverted winger no way it has to be a straight line thing which is probably why he's a natural straight line winger um 14 10 8 firm vision and 12 passing is an okay pivot for a winger um 12 i mean no no 13 first touch 14 dribbling 12 there eight decisions bruv so he's good at picking up the ball and running in a straight line and crossing it and shooting from far that's it 
that's all he can really do. But just be aware that he might not choose the right decision because man's got eight decisions in it. So in a shooting situation, he will cross it. In a crossing situation, he'll probably shoot it as well. That's the kind of guy Lewis Morgan is. I'm just out of intrigue trying to see where he's been. And and Rangers is calm. Um, Celtic is also calm, but there's probably a reason why he got moved to the MLS. And I think it's what I said still. Man like Lewis Morgan, shocking ability. I can't lie, it's, it's kind of embarrassing still. Let's move. Please do not put these guys in the first team. Man's got full strength. He's vulnerable. All right, and it's got man like Matias Pellegrini. Um, left straight, straight line left winger once again. You get me another one, Matias Pellegrini. 20, winger on support, 14 dribbling, 12 place, um, 15 agility for acceleration. It's just okay movement for a left mid, not even a winger. Um, mentally, he's actually really good and technically he's got very good technical ability. A pivot of um, 15 technique, 12 vision and 12 passing. It's actually calm, like it's decent for a winger. Close range shooting is decent and you know what, you know what, I'm probably, sounds mad, probably going to put this guy as a little advanced forward, you know, like a little advanced forward. So if I was going to play him, I'm putting him down the middle still, like he hasn't got the real like explosive movement that I would like from a winger. Still moving, just not at speed and as a striker, he'll probably like get a lot more chances to use his technical ability and mental ability to like his greater good in it. Yeah, man, like Matthias Pellegrini, he's a good player though, I'll be real, let's move. All right, another one, see they've got a couple like, I'm thinking about maximum five very decent players and this is another one man like Rodolfo Pizarro like he's actually kind of good still now um 16 pace he's meant to be a left mid or a cam 16 pace full injury and 13 acceleration is very good movement like he's definitely moving with that um flair 15 so he's got unpredictability as well and 15 dribbling so he's got the ability now to actually skin someone like he can genuinely take the piss out of someone on live tv which is always a good ent and, and entertaining thing like I'll accept that still now He's, he's dangerous. I can't even lie. Like, I'll be real, yeah? In terms of distribution, getting assistant, that I will not be surprised, regardless of his seven composure, like, that's not really important right now. What's important is that he's got 15, 10, 15 vision and 14 passing. So, in terms of getting assist, I won't be surprised if he's actually, like, pushing for the most assist in the season. Like, I'll be real. Like, he's genuinely looking very decent still. Um, if they've got, like, a big striker, Oh wait, I know who their striker is. Yeah, if they were to do a little link up thing, him and Higuain, they would do a madness together. I'll be real, man. Like, um, Pizarro, he's actually a good player. I'll be real, man. Very good player. P -p fuck it. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Do not let these young players in the first team. This young man's got free strength. He's vulnerable. All right, next we've got man like Julian Carranza. He's twenty, advanced forward, um, thirteen technique, nine vision, nine passing, um, decent off the ball, which is thirteen finishing, thirteen first touch, thirteen dribbling, twelve. Composure, concentration and decisions are all great, but he is 20, so it could definitely improve. And he's just looking like he's going to develop to be a bang average striker. That's what it's looking like. I'll be real. So um, I know if he's got um, Higuain, like if, if Higuain takes him under his wing, he might improve in terms of like finishing. And then I'll probably put him as a poacher, maybe. Like if he gets if he gets the um, finishing and off the ball up, then I'll put him as a poacher still. Just get goals because obviously his pivot is never looking like it's going to improve. I'll be real. So yeah, man, like Julian Carenza, man will improve him to the point where he's a poacher, just providing goals still. See, man, like Gonzalo Higuain, bruv. I'll be real. Yeah, he looks like he could definitely like do what Zlatan did, yeah, and just go back to an Italian team and just shell it down. Like that's what he looks like he could do because stats wise. He's looking very, very good. Like I remember when he came to Chelsea and I was laughing because the signing looks deadly, but on the pitch he just didn't know how to move in it. Like he just didn't know how to move like at speed or anything. It was flipping hilarious. But um in Italy, like man's definitely gonna be very, very deadly still. So yeah, that's what I would recommend he do he would do in it. But yeah, anyway, when you look at the stats, yeah, 16, 10, 14 vision and 14 passing is a very good pivot for a striker, especially like it got to the point, yeah, when I'm looking at that pivot, I didn't even know his passing was like this. I'll be real. Um, decisions. Man's playing very similar to like Harry Kane in the fact that man's a cam and a striker in one, isn't it? Like it's mad, bruv. 16 strength, um, 17 finishing. He can actually dribble. Um, flares under average by one, but that's cool. He's he's very well rounded in the air. 15 heading, like 16 strength. Overall, he's, he's a very good striker in this game. Man, like Gonzalo Higuain, I already said you could probably sign this guy. Like if they're willing to let him go, you could definitely put him as your striker. Like it's not going to be long term. Man's one ligament away from osteoporosis, but never like like don't mind that yeah man's man's definitely like gonna be very effective still man like Gonzalo Higuain good player and that is Inter Miami bruv um I'll be real um at the beginning of that video I was not expecting anything like I was not expecting nothing and I'll be real instead of like leaving the video 
like um, angry or, or like shocked at how bad they really were expecting them to be bad anyway I've kind of left the video like you know what they're actually not the end of the world in it like they've got a couple like five players I'll be real maybe it's because some of the players were actually really good for example Higuain Matuidi that's probably why in it so yeah um, I'm not lining them up though because five players out of 11 is really not that great let's be real but it's it's decent anyway but yeah um that's into miami shout out mark clark one more time you man joined the discord and yeah if you like that video like that video subscribe to the content you'll expect from me and i'll see you in my next episode bro.